The Supreme Court issues a notice to the Centre and the Medical Council of India on a plea for the CBI probe into alleged illegal clinical drugs, trials of drugs. For more, let's go across to Minakshi who's joining us. Minakshi, give us the latest details on this very critical Supreme Court notice. Yes, Rudin, this is a matter which has uh, come up for considerable scrutiny from time to time. And today, a petition, a fresh petition, uh, was filed by an NGO called Swasthya Adhikar Manch. And today, the Supreme Court has issued uh, notice uh, seeking CBI investigations into the alleged illegal uh, drug trials of untested drugs. Now, the notice has been issued to the Ministry of Health, the Medical Council of India, and uh, the court essentially has deemed it appropriate to end entertain the petition because uh, the petition now raises some very serious concerns saying that uh, such illegal or alleged illegal usage of clinical drugs has been taking uh, uh, taking place for a while now in Madhya Pradesh alongside its site instances where it is no longer just confined to MP but other places of India as well and therefore the plea is seeking investigations into this entire alleged usage of uh, 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 clinical drugs and the court has now deemed it appropriate to hear the matter, it has admitted the petition, and uh, by way of admittance, it has uh, today uh, issued notices and uh, sought replies uh, from the Medical Council of India and uh, the centre. Rhythm. Minakshi, at this point of time, the petition is seeking formation of a committee to regulate drug trials by MNCs. Take us through some of the allegations that have been made in the court against these companies. Why is there illegal drug testing going on despite such PILs coming to the Supreme Court? Well, Rhythm, essentially uh, what this PIL is seeking to do is this, that it is seeking a, a comprehensive investigation of uh, the illicit uh, usage of uh, clinical drugs. It, uh, the p petition seeks to elaborate on the fact that this problem is now no longer. Uh, earlier, you'll recall, there were reports which had surfaced which said that uh, the usage of such drugs was... We have lost Minakshi on the phone line, but at this point of time, the latest that's coming and the Supreme Court is issuing a notice to the Center as well as the Medical Council of India for a CBI probe into alleged illegal clinical trials of drugs. Let's go across to the petitioner in the Supreme Court, Amulya Nidhi, who's joining us on the phone line. Sir, at this point of time, what were the contentions in the Supreme Court that made the Supreme Court issue a notice on your PIL to the government? Uh, basically, we had filed a uh, PIL from on behalf of Swas Adhikar Manch, which is a network of uh, various uh, groups working on clinical drug trials. So we had filed a, a case about uh, finding out there is lots of lacuna in the rules of the Drug and Cosmetic Act, and also the what is the whole role of uh, the Contract Research Organization, Independent Ethics Committee, and also we had uh, uh, expressed our concern over lots of several more than 1,700 deaths has been happening from last 2007 to 2010 and also more than 4, around 4,000 trials has been conducted in India from last 2005 to 2010.